Hello everybody, hope you're doing good today. Thanks for checking out my Amanda Seyfried makeup tutorial. Um, it's just a basic look. It's actually inspired from her look in Letters to Juliet. Um, I had a request for this, so thank you for requesting it. And um, I think it's gonna be pretty simple, but really pretty and natural looking. So keep on watching if you're interested. All right, so I've already got all my foundation on and stuff, and you really wanna focus on being pretty natural looking with that, nothing too heavy or cakey. Um, as most of the time is best anyway. So um, I've already put on the Palladio Herbal Eyeshadow Primer and then I'm going to use the NYX uh, Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Milk. And I'm just gonna go ahead and put a little bit of this on my lid area, um, just so that the colors show up on there a little bit more opaque, I guess I would say. Um, Cause a lot of times, I don't know, the eyeshadow base works okay, but sometimes you just need that extra bit of um, you know, it's kind of like a glue almost for the eyeshadow, so. so I'm just blending that in. Just make sure you don't get too much because it tends to get creasy easily. Alrighty, so the first eyeshadow color I'm using is by MAC and it's called Naked Lunch. It's kind of a shimmery peachy color, um, kind of neutral. And then I'm just using a large flat eyeshadow brush from Sonia Kashuk. And this is going to be our base color, so I'm going to go ahead and put this all over my eyelid area, or all over from the lash line up to the eyebrow. Okay, so once you have that all over your eyelid area, I'm gonna go ahead and take, um, I'm gonna use the Cargo Essential Palette in Dark Neutral, which is one of my favorites, and I'm gonna start with the Brow Bone color. Just a really light uh, neutral color with, it's more of a satin, it's not quite matte, but it's not shimmery, so um, it's just a really pretty finish on it. And I'm using a denser eyeshadow brush for this, and I'm gonna start with applying it to my eyelid. and just to the crease. All right, and the next color I'm gonna use is the crease color, which is just a medium um, once again, kind of a satin brown color, and I'm using my um, blending or my crease brush from Sonia Kashuk. So we're just going to start by applying a small amount of this all the way into in the crease area. And then I'm gonna get a little more on the brush and then just kind of bring it out a little bit further so it's kind of a little bit of a V shape on that outer corner. And you can bring it just a tiny bit onto the outer corner of the lid but not too much. Alrighty, so that's all you need for eyeshadow. And next you wanna take a brown eyeliner of some kind. I'm using Prestige Ultimate Eye Definer in Carbon Brown. And this has a little sponge tip on the end for blending out, which is exactly what I need for this look. Um, you can also use an eyeshadow, a dark brown eyeshadow for this if you want, which is gonna be a lot easier. So, um, but this is gonna still be pretty simple to do with that um, sponge tip on the end. So basically all I'm gonna do is apply a pretty much a line all the way across, not super thin, but just, just kind of medium, I guess. And then I'll blend it out with the sponge and then I'll put a little bit underneath the eye as well. So I'll let you watch that. So 
So if you have a hard time applying a pencil liner, the best thing to do is just to do little strokes, um, just kind of like you're sketching something or um, if you're artistic at all. But And then holding the pencil to the side instead of straight on will help a bit with that too. And especially if your pencil is sharp enough, it doesn't have to be like pointy necessarily, like sharp pointy, but you need it to have some sort of point to it. Okay, so that's perfect, perfect amount there. And I'm going to take that sponge tip on the end and just start going over it about the same way. This will tend to make it a little bit thicker looking as well, but not quite as dark. And then just with what's left over on there, I take it to the bottom. So you have a little bit of definition down there. All right, so I'll do the other side and then I will go ahead and put um, some eyebrow gel on and then add a little bit of mascara. I've been using this Almay Intense Eye Color uh, Mascara in, I think this is black, black flash is what it's called. So it's kind of a little bit more natural looking which will be great for this look. So I'll do that and then I'll come back and show you the easy cheeks and lips. All right, so the eyes are finished now, and for the cheeks, I'm using um, NYX blush in Summer Peach, which is kind of a peachy um, blush with, it's definitely, it has a bit more pink to it than peach, or than orange, I guess, um, with some gold shimmer. So I'm using my Sonia Kashuk blush brush for this. I'm using a lot of her brushes today. They're good, and they're not too expensive either. All right, so for this, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply it kind of to the apples of the cheek, and just bring it out a little bit too. Then I'm just going to take my powder brush and just kind of blend it out a little bit. Alright, and for the lips, um, she's definitely wearing a pretty neutral lipstick with possibly some gloss on top. So I'm just going to be using my um, Napoleon Paradis from, um, I get this at Ulta, but it's their Divine Lipstick in Hess. Um, so it's just a very neutral color. It's pretty light um, compared to some. So I'm going to use that and then I'm going to put on top of it my uh, Bare Essentials Buxom in Dolly, which is kind of a little bit of a plum color to it. So I'll do that and then you'll see the finished look. All right, everybody. So this is my finished Amanda Seyfried um, look from Letters to Juliet. I don't actually know her character's name. I could have looked that up, but I haven't seen the movie yet. So hopefully, hopefully I will sometime. I think it's, I've heard it's pretty good. So anyway, thank you so much for watching this video, you guys. I hope you're having a great holiday time and um, I'll definitely be hopefully putting some Christmas looks up, especially kind of party, kind of more fun looks um, in the near future. So keep checking back and thank you. I'll see you later. Bye. I'm making a video, Beck. Right now? Yes. Oh! It's okay, I'm gonna cut out this side anyway, but still. I'm gonna shut your door. Okay.